Hi there. Are you ready for another kiss? A kinetic interactive sculpture show. Hey, hi there. For the month of January 2011, I had an art show at the Beaverton City Hall in Beaverton, Oregon through the Beaverton Arts Commission. And this is the show that I had. And if by chance you missed it, you're going to get a chance to uh, see the sculptures here now. First sculpture here is a nice little rose sculpture I made. It's made out of brass. It's got a very nice patina on it here. It's fun the way the roots roll down and, and make a base for it. Next to that I have another rose that's got a couple uh, interesting elements here. It's got another unopened bud with a little bee sculpture that's made out of found objects. It's got washers for the wings and a, uh, a wood screw for the stinger and little ball bearings for the eyes. And it also has a base made out of roots to hold it up. And there's my logo down there. Got the CH for Clay Hoffman. Next sculpture we got here is my little buddy Scrappy. Everybody knows Scrappy from my, uh, my little art shows. He's the official greeter. You can shake Scrappy's hand here and uh, take a business card. Got the business card right here. Thanks, Scrappy. Next sculpture we have is a kinetic sculpture of a guy on a bicycle. And then the kinetic element is up here. Just give it a little twirl and he spins around on his finger. Very nice piece. It's got an integrated base down here. It says, please spin slowly. We also have another kinetic sculpture here. This one is of Oregon State Tree, the Doug Fir. And it's got a kinetic element of a biplane with a guy in a parachute. Story here is the airplane had some problems, pilot had to parachute out, now the airplane is chasing the pilot around this tree. Got some nice rocks down here at the base with the roots. The uh, wood base here has been wire brushed to bring out the wood grain so it looks like waves and this would be like a little island sticking out of a uh, a body of water. Really nice sculpture. Next to that I've got one of my little spaceship sculptures here and this is made out of some recycled stereo speakers and it's got the magic of the floating magnet up here. Why does it float? It's magic. Got a little Martian guy up here on the top. We have another little Martian guy down here on a bungee cord and he will stick to this bottom magnet down here and this shows how ferrous metals stick to magnets while the rest of his body which is copper and brass does not stick non-ferrous metals do not stick to magnets got some nice little feet on this piece here real big long legs Next to that sculpture is a nice little Day of the Dead altar piece. This one was done in memory of my mom who was a painter. And this is her painting. One of the last paintings she worked on when she was alive. A couple little angels up in the sky. This sculpture does have some kinetic elements here. The, uh, the head turns around and um, it's just a real fun piece. Got a nice big skull up here on the top. Could represent my father looking over the mom working at her studio. Next to that I've got a really giant rose sculpture here. It's about three and a half feet tall made out of brass and copper. Nice little copper base down here with integrated roots. Very good piece. 
So our last sculpture down here is another one of my spaceship sculptures and this one is also made with recycled stereo speakers. Has the mystical magical floating magnet up here. Opposites attract, likes repel. And we've got the uh, evolution of my little Martian critters here. First one started out pretty plain, made some changes, added more mass, ball bearing eyeballs, and finally came to be looking like this little critter right here. And this guy's got three eyes and big tentacle fingers and kind of like little pad feet and he's good for talking about why his steel ball bearing eyes stick to a magnet but his copper and brass body does not again ferrous and non-ferrous metal so this was my art show here at the Beaverton City Hall for the month of January 2011 if you uh, didn't get a chance to get out here and see it, now you have. And Scrappy actually, Scrappy's jaw goes up and down here. He's, uh, he's got a lot of moving parts here. His shoulders are got magnets on them and that's a, that's a real fun sculpture. And then we got the roses. Okay, well that's it for now. Well, we'll see you around. <laughs>